Benny, it's a nice day to be out by the pool, but there was a bit more to it than just a few swims. Uh, what sort of activities were the boys doing today? Yeah, look, um, it was a beautiful day out here, or a beautiful morning. We're looking at different ways within our program to, um, you know, just keep improving ourselves. This is about us and us improving. So with Mark Visser, um, he's obviously got a history of um, big wave surfing, and, and so that was really beneficial to the players to really hear about um, how he's dealt with fear, anxiety, being in uncomfortable situations um, and how that can you know, potentially relate to our players out on the field. So it was really uh, a fun way of doing it, um, a fun way of learning um, how the mind controls the body um, and, and so yeah, I think the boys got a fair bit out of it. And so where does the swimming element sort of come into this? Well, I think in reality there's no need for swimming for water, you know, for someone that's not a water athlete. But the reason we use water is there's no hiding mentally. If you're challenged mentally in a water scenario, if you said, oh yeah, yeah, I understand what you're saying, well, you're going to have to come up. If you, if you stumbled across, you know, a certain block that came up. On the land, if someone said, yeah, yeah, I'm fine, we wouldn't actually know if they were or they weren't. Whereas in the water, you can't hide. There's no hiding in the water, and they had to. They were put in a situation that made them feel vulnerable, made them feel way out of their comfort zone, and that's what it was: was a mental process of breaking down fear, feelings of anxiety, feelings of uh, something new, a place they hadn't been before, and how they handle it. The boys looked like they had a smile on their face. Do you think they took a lot out of it? Yeah, I do. There was a couple of guys that were pretty uh, worried about jumping in the water and you know holding their breath for. 25 metres and um, you know dealing with that anxiety so to see those guys I think Oscar McDonald got a pretty big um, cheer and, and Jake Melksham so it was great to see those guys um, you know come out of themselves and deal with a bit of uh, fear and overcome it so yeah it's fantastic. Yeah I think the biggest thing um, that we've left with the group is mentally they might have a challenge or a task that comes to, the, to them at any point and as a playing group it may not seem achievable like no matter what, even the coaching staff got to a point where we set out an exercise that 100% of people said it couldn't be done. And what we're really doing is just teaching them how to get out of the head, stop thinking, and actually tap into to the soul, so to speak. Uh, it's a bit different, um, but tapping into a place where they can feel versus think. And that was the biggest thing for the group was they were able just to focus on one thing at a time, one task at a time, instead of looking too far ahead down the track. And, uh, the results were super impressive. The whole entire group um, smashed the record of what they didn't even think was possible and uh, it was super rewarding to see.